Seven on your side investigation about a mob associate who survived numerous botched assassination attempts before being gunned down in a restaurant parking lot. I tell you, the man charged with the murder learned his fate. Investigative reporter Dan Kraut with more on this case. He had a desk job by day working as a job recruiter, but at night, Bouchon Shelton was a Bloods gang member. <laughs> what the fuck, man? That's the mob. What the fuck? He had a desk job by day. Night he was a good blood. You would you would tell people at his job would like probably see him getting arrested like in the parking lot. Like say the the police had to like serve a warrant or they you know they 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 finally caught up to him at this job. All the white people would come out. Let him go. Get off of a shot. You don't know him. He's one of the good ones. They be cussing out the cops and shit, pulling out the cameras and shit. This is uncalled for. It's harassment. It's racial profiling. He had a desk job by day, working as a job recruiter. But at night, Bouchon Shelton was a Bloods gang member, and someone recruited him to kill Sylvester Satola. It was an old-fashioned hit right out of a, of a mobster movie. The target of that hit, a businessman with a multi-million dollar real estate portfolio, a father of three, and a mob associate, friends with Vinny Gorgias of the Bonanno crime family. Does the mob still exist? The Bonanos. He was a good earner. This guy was a good earner right here. Multi-million dollar. Um... Real estate company. Yeah. yeah, he was a good earner, man. The target of that hit, a businessman with a multi-million dollar real estate portfolio, a father of three, and a mob associate, friends with Vinnie Gorgias of the Bonanno crime family. Does the mob still exist today? Very much so. But police and prosecutors had a hunch from the beginning. The mob wasn't behind it. Too many mistakes. First surveillance video shows a total... <laughs> They do that, and then police is like, they, God, do this. <laughs> they knew that shit was the sun. Too many botches. Oh my God. I mean, I mean, yo, come yeah. on, y'all. They said too many mistakes. <laughs> they knew it wasn't the mob. <laughs> come on, y'all. It wasn't organized crime at all. It was definitely sun crime. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. I mean, like, come on, man. Press one. Is race a construct? I don't think race is a construct. Press one. Race is not a social construct, man. Race is real, Jack. They could tell they had no idea who was doing this. They just knew right. it. Was <laughs> That's fucking wild. And why would they? Why would the Italians even try to use the Suns? They know for years that we've been fucking shit up. That's crazy. Yeah, even in fucking Sopranos, man, they, they, they tried to use them Suns that one time. Remember, they tried to use the Suns to um, whack, um, it was whack the balls, and then yeah. they then they called it off. And then when the Suns came to pick up the money, they whacked them. Yeah, man, the Suns still wanted to get paid for for a fucking hit they got called off. <laughs> Yeah, that's how we beat too, for real. Yeah. <laughs> man. What's the guy from fucking um Goodfellas who the J Samuel Jackson? Stacks. Yeah, Stacks. He yeah, got that's the, what, that he was got the burn up the truck. That was the, <laughs> me, my brother was talking about that shit. I swear to God, we beat my brother talking about that. That's some <laughs> typical sun shit. <laughs> fuck around some hoes, smoking, drinking, fell asleep, didn't fucking finish the job. <laughs> and, then they, and then they found the truck and they was able to leak it back to the fucking about the biggest <laughs> fucking hit in the LaFanza, La yeah, the LaFanza heist. All because of the sun. <laughs> Cause somebody forgot to fucking burn this truck and burn it up. <laughs> oh my god, man! Oh man, it's today. Very much so. But police and prosecutors had a hunch from the beginning. The mob wasn't behind it. Too many mistakes. First surveillance video shows Zatola getting punched to the ground and beaten outside his Bronx home back in September of 2017. He survives. Then someone breaks into his home a few months later and slashes his throat. He pulls through. Later in 20... <laughs> that's crazy. I mean, yeah. that's your home, but God damn. Yo. This Yo, think about if he was going to testify, right? This isn't... This isn't even him trying to keep him from testifying. They're just trying to kill him for something else. 
Imagine if you was going to testify. You got these uh, this son word to take him out. Yeah, all y'all going to jail, man. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas is telling. <laughs> Yo. Zatola getting punched to the ground and beaten outside his Bronx home back in September of 2017. He survives. Then someone breaks into his home a few months later and slashes his throat. He pulls through. Later in 2018, a gunman points a gun at his head, but it jams and Zatola fires back. <laughs> Holy shit. Three times? That motherfucker got nine lives. And then no more. Not no more. Look at the shit. Two of them were on camera. Like the sun just. <laughs> Yo, we can't do shit right. But this is why the mob, this is why, this is the difference. When they describe Italian crime, it's called organized crime. When they describe our crime, it's called senseless. Senseless. That's the facts. They use that word all the time. Yeah. Right. Senseless. And that's racist too, man. As a as an actual black criminal, man, I'm 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 a, I'm a, I'm gonna make a fuss about that. Man. It's, it's, we should do we should do that class after suit. <laughs> yeah, stop 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 calling our crime sisters. That's racist. Man. Right. <laughs> Shit, man. <laughs> video shows Zatola getting punched to the ground and beaten outside his Bronx home back in September of 2017. He survives. Then someone breaks into his home a few months later and slashes his throat. He pulls through. Later in 2018, a gunman points a gun at his head, but it jams and Zatola fires back. He lived in fear for the last year of his life. There is no doubt about that. You spoke with him? Yes, I did. What were your conversations like with him? There was a lot of fear and frustration. I mean, he was genuinely terrified about what was happening and how that could impact his family. Then another twist. Someone tries to kill not just him, but one of his two sons. Starts firing at him after getting out of his car. And then the son literally rolls away from death. It was just a series of oh, mistake after me. Think about this. That son didn't even kill this guy. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> that Look how crazy. up close he was. He's right there. <laughs> but think about it. If he didn't want to kill this guy, say he was shooting at someone else, he could have killed this guy. No, bullshit. <laughs> he could have killed this guy just by trying to kill someone else in the vicinity. That's what you got to do with said hitman, man. You got to be like, yo. <laughs> or you go... Kill you, you point at the guy next to the guy that you want to kill, <laughs> right? Kill that guy right there, and he's like, Oh, hell, boom! And he's like, Yeah, good job, <laughs> good job right? Yo, he's literally right on him, and he's missed. <laughs> All he's doing is rolling, it's not that hard. He doesn't, and he doesn't get any blanker than that. Man. <laughs> point wrong. blank is this is, doesn't. Something is wrong, man. It, it, it's it's we're different, man, and and I accept the differences. See, that's why people get mad at you when you accept the differences. I'm not saying that you know. Listen, I spot out shit with gliders. I spot out shit with with, with tigers. I spot out everything. This shit is just glaring, man. It's glaring. Juice Group Cut says a son man was used to assassinate Joe Colombo. In their heyday, Cosa Nostra would have this son man buried in multiple locations with a matter of hours. Within a matter of hours, even the mob in 2023 can't blot out the sun. Yeah, man. This shit is, I mean, God, dog. I mean, shit. This guy's like right there. You couldn't kill this guy. And, and here's the thing. Sons were good killers, man. We're very good killers. Especially back in the days, the eighties. What? Woo. Yeah, I don't, just don't understand. Like, if, if it's, it's, I think it's the pressure of having to do it. Like, yo, yo, I want this guy killed. When it becomes a business transaction, instead of just like, yo, man, that nigga, yo, we was at the club last night. Nigga was faking, man. We about to go ride on them niggas. Yeah. That, that shit, we'll get that done every time. When it's like. All right, you get five thousand now and five thousand after the job's done. Here's a picture of his. Here's a here's his address and a picture of him and um, three or four locations where he normally frequents. Um, 
contact me for correspondence on the, on this burner phone. It, it wasn't used all that shit that we just can't. We can't. It's a business yeah, deal. We can't. Too much directions. Too much directions. Yeah. Like, your, your, your sister called you. He hit me. Quartavius just hit me. Can y'all come over here? And then they come over there and kill Quartavius and shoot somebody down the street. He killed him too by accident. We good at that shit. We just not good at hits, man. We not good at that shit, man. Look at this shit, man. It's the fourth hit. The One fourth of his two God, come on, y'all. This is where <laughs> this is the fourth time. Like, come on. If this guy was set to testify against them, yo, they would all be in jail. You would the, the court date those court date looming. This guy's gonna testify and he's gonna get all of us locked up, man. You need to kill him. And the sun man, if you get a sun man a job. Thunts starts firing at him after getting out of his car. And then the sun literally rolls away from death. It was just a series of mistake after mistake after mistake, but they kept going. But Zatola couldn't escape death in October of 2018 when entering a McDonald's drive through shot multiple times after ordering a cup of coffee. And what happened there? Some guy got shot in the parking lot. A tracking device on his car and cell phone messages led police to the man behind the hit. One thing I can say is I had a feeling you were coming. Sylvester's own son, his youngest, Anthony. What is the motive behind this? He would inherit it all what anyway. Yeah, he would have definitely inherited it someday, right? But sometime for some people, someday is not fast enough. Prosecutor said Anthony hired Shelton to do his dirty work, and Shelton then hired other gang members to pull the trigger. So really, the text messages are everything to this case. They really are. There's one uh, very significant message minutes after the murder where Anthony says to Shelton, it's my little man, B-Day. I'm taking him to his favorite place, McDonald's, then a movie, LOL. Thank you for being a great friend, my man. Four minutes after his father was murdered, he's saying LOL. Essentially, minutes after the murder, that's how he's responding to Shelton. In the courtroom today, the judge said those text messages reflect a sense of excitement rather than a sense of remorse. And he sentenced Shelton to 37 years behind bars. Anthony Zatola was sentenced to life in prison back in April. So the son man got 37 years, man, which is what? That's um about eight years for every attempted hit. <laughs> 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 took him five, five times to kill the guy, man. God damn, man. Come on. It took you five times, bro. Like, it shit. was the same guy every time? Well, he it was, it was his gang. They said he was. Um, oh yeah, Get, getting different guys. Yeah, he was, he was he was he was he was getting paid by the son, and then he was paying gang members. My God, just, just, Jesus Christ, man. God, man. Mm, 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 mm. That's why there's no DEI in the mob, man. Ain't no diversity. <laughs> no, they no. just, they just don't the fuck them. with those words. Right. <laughs> yeah, you got you got to have the Italian blood to be fuck with that shit. Yeah, fuck y'all, man. 